Lunch, it's one of the three meals you have every day. But if you're a busy working adult, it's usually a grab-and-go affair. Yeah, no time to sit down and enjoy. But you know what? Sometimes you should absolutely treat yourself. And that's why on this episode of Eating Out with Hawkerpedia, we are going to check out Venus. So let's go. So Venus is a new restaurant located at 198 South Bridge Road. They specialize in Asian fusion cuisine. And I know what you're thinking, this place looks so atas, the prices must be quite atas too. But, but no. no! Their set lunches are actually super value for money, starting at just 28 plus plus or 38 plus plus for a two or three course set. So they've got stuff like duck confit, beef rib eye or pork sirloin to choose from. All right, and we have our appetizers here. It looks good and fancy. We have the soup of the day, which today is the cream of corn. And this is their ha chong gai. Now, I know you might be familiar with ha chong gai, but theirs is definitely different from what you know. It's topped with goji jam and caviar and presented nicely on a bit of mayonnaise. All right, it's good. You can taste the calamansi and the batter. Such a nice contrast to the crispiness. Plus, you get the sweetness from the goji jam and a bit of savouriness from that caviar. A very fancy hachongkai. Now, we're going to try their soup of the day, which today is cream of corn. I'm just going to get all the stuff from the bottom. Mm. And you know the thing about cream of something soups is that they tend to be really heavy and rich. You can tell that this is not going to fill you up or bloat you. So you have space to eat the rest of your set lunch, you know? Mm. So good. Okay, so appetizers are done. It's time for course number two, my favorite course in a three course meal, which is the mains. I've got the Iberico pork sirloin, which comes with sweet and sour sauce and roasted potatoes. And I have the Cool Bara Baramundi, which comes with burnt lettuce and a clam and scallion emulsion. You know the cost of one dish alone here, either the fish or the pork, at other places, it would set you back the cost of this entire set lunch. So it's really super worth it. Yeah. Alright, so when they say Asian fusion, right? This pork sirloin and that sweet and sour sauce gives you a bit of a reminder of your usual sweet and sour pork. Mm. But of course, that sauce is not as sweet as the usual ones we have. And that pork, man, that pork is so juicy and so tender. This, this pig was a good boy when he was alive. <laughs> So now I'm going to tuck into the barramundi. Oh, how nice that crispy skin is. <gasps> I'm so excited. Look what at that meat? flakiness. Oh. Mm. That skin is so nice and crispy. My God, can you hear that crunch? Yes. And the fish is so nice and flaky and they got the temperature just right. I'm going to try the burnt lettuce now. Mmm, that's very different. 100% recommend. So good. Since we're already here, we thought we'd try one of their signature dishes, which is their Venus scallops. Yeah. So it's pan seared with ginger garlic chive oil and then drizzled with a sesame shoyu glaze. Dip into the glaze. Mmm, that's a very interesting texture. And like, like a glass of red wine in a way. Yeah, a very... So cute, it's served in a scallop shell. Oh, glaze it up. Mm. Yeah, I cannot describe this in ways that you will understand unless you try it yourself, mm. right? And now it's my favourite part of the three-course set lunch, the dessert! So I have the profiterole, which comes with chocolate sauce and chantilly cream. And I have the madelines, which come with a passion orange marmalade. Passion orange marmalade, which you can see actual slices of the orange in there. Mm. The marmalade is next level. And the madelines itself are also really nice and fluffy, so I'm not complaining. It's really good. Okay, so moving on from the madelines, we have the profiterole. So crispy on the outside and fluffy on the in. Ooh, see the cream. Mm. Mm. Crunchy on the outside, creamy on the inside. Not too overly sweet. 
And not, not too overpowering, yeah. Got just a hint of oolong flavour, you know, so that uh, in case you don't like your desserts to be too sweet. So I'm going to get some. Yeah, I'm going to get some of the chocolate sauce. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <gasps> mm. It's so good, the chocolate. <laughs> so I added a bit of the Chantilly cream to my oolong cream because, you know, go big or go home. I know it's going to sound weird, but it just makes the cream creamier. <laughs> but in a good way, you know, because the Chantilly cream has a different taste profile from the Oolong cream. Very satisfying. Check out Venus at 198 South Bridge Road. That's it for this episode of Eating Out with Hawkopedia. We'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Remember to like, share and subscribe. Oh yeah, yeah, correct, correct.